What is up, YouTube Nation? It is your girl Tay, and I am back with yet another video or whatever. First and foremost, I want to tell those of you who are already subscribed, welcome back, fam, bam. Y'all know I love y'all for free, 24-7, 365, 366 in a leap year. For those of you who haven't joined the family, do me a solid one time for the one time. Hit that subscribe button, go ahead and slide your wrist to the right and tap that notification bell so that way you're notified every time on time I upload a video. And I'm going to say thank you in advance because I already know y'all about to hold me down or whatever. And while you're here, if you like what you see, don't forget to like, share, and comment. Okay, so now that we got all that technical stuff out the way, let's talk about why we're really here. <laughs> so we are here because I want to review this unit that I'm rocking right now for you all. Now, before y'all go in my comments and go nuts, no, this is not paid promotion. No, I'm not getting a kickback. No, I did not get a discount. Y'all know me. Anybody who's been fan bam for a minute know that one thing I can't do is keep a good wig fine to myself. <laughs> and today is no different. Now, if you want to see the actual application of the wig, go ahead and check down below. I'll also include the link at the end of the video so you can go and check that out. But for now, let's focus on the wig. So what are the specs? It's eight inches, Brazilian curly, it's a lace front in the color 1B, and it's considered a pixie wig. Where did I buy it? Amazon. Now I believe the company's name is pronounced Kung Gong, but I'm gonna put that in the description down below just in case I'm wrong. I paid, I think $80 for this wig. Yeah, I want to say $80, but y'all will see that in the link or what have you. The cons, aka what I don't love about the wig. There are three of them, and they're the reason I personally feel like the price of the unit should be decreased. Now, number one, in the description of the unit, you say that they're bleached knots. Unless those knots started out jet black, those are not bleached knots. And you're probably thinking, okay, it's no big deal, Tay, just bleach them. That works for me because I know I bleach knots. But what about that person who maybe is a beginner? You just set them up for failure because now they're going to have to put foundation or concealer and cake that all along the top of their wig just so it doesn't look like they got ants dancing in their hairline. That's strike number one. Number two, these grids, they're so noticeable to me. Now, that might be a matter of preference, but I don't know, y'all, look. Are they super noticeable to y'all? I do not like the grids on this unit. That's number two. Number three, she sheds. Not excessively to a point where I'd be like, oh, I'm not going to be able to wear this more than a few times. It's going to last probably at least eight months. Worst case scenario. Best case scenario, it'll last a whole year because it has a 150 density, I believe. So it'll last, but the fact that it sheds to me is reason enough to decrease the price Now you're like well it's already pretty affordable tay yes but this is an eight inch lace front wig there are wigs with longer hair <laughs> that cause less than this one and normally the way hair is priced is based on the quality of hair and the length this is only eight inches and almost 90 bucks let's talk about the pros aka the things i love about this unit they're like five things the first thing is the curls are so soft, y'all. Like I could take this wig off <laughs> and sleep on it. The curls are so soft. Imagine like the softest baby blanket. That's how it feels. Which leads me to my next point. Not only is it soft, but it maintains a curl pattern. Usually curly hair doesn't keep such a defined curl without it being kind of stiff. That is not what this wig is. It is not stiff at all. Like, look at that bounce. Y'all see that curl? Living his best life. So it's soft and it maintains the same level of curl definition. I didn't have to cake it with product and again, make it super stiff. I just spritzed it with some water, 
put probably about a quarter size of flaxseed gel in the palm of my hand, did this and picked out my hair. That's literally all I did, which leads me to number three, maintenance. This has to be one of the most low maintenance units I have ever had. I literally just tie my head up at night, get up in the morning, wet it, and throw just a tiny bit of that gel in there. And I don't even think it needed it. I just do it because it's second nature. Whenever I wear a curly unit, I throw flaxseed gel in it. I always do that. But I also normally will have to add like some mousse or something like that. I didn't have to do that with this unit. In fact, it's one of those units where the less product, the better. So if you're looking for something that maybe you just wanna be able to get up in the morning and go, this takes like five minutes. And then I threw this little alligator clip in here for good measure, cause I thought I was cute. <laughs> So I absolutely love it. One thing I want to point out to y'all, I know y'all see that little brown spot. I let the bleach bleed into the unit a little bit because I wasn't paying attention. That's not the wig, that's me. And it's not a bald spot, it's actually hair. It's just light brown because I didn't do what I was supposed to. <laughs> so we talked about the soft texture. We talked about the curl definition. We talked about the fact that it was low maintenance. What else do I love about this baby? It's comfortable, y'all, not, not just is it textured on the outside and super soft. This has to be one of the most comfortable wig caps I have ever worn. Like normally I either feel it scratching my scalp or it's making me itch, but this has to be the softest wig cap I have ever had. Like, I love it. And last but certainly not least, this is a beginner friendly wig because they pluck the hairline very well on this unit. The cap construction is easy. It has combs in it. It has adjustable straps, which you'll see in a few minutes. The only thing of course, is that not bleaching the knots thing. That's a pet peeve of mine. And if you're not gonna bleach the knots, don't say that. But if you're looking for that beginner wig where if you're not as experienced with units, that you want to try out and not lose a lot of money out on, this is it. It's low maintenance. It's easy to wear. You don't have to use adhesives. I did, and you can see the application video below. So would I buy the unit again? Absolutely. In fact, I'm gonna hurry up and stock up before the company realize how great it is and then jack up the prices on us. <laughs> So yes, definitely will buy again. Now I know it's easy to look at me and be like, oh, well, you know how to do wigs or whatever. So no wonder you think that it's so great for beginners. Cause I've been on the other side where I've purchased the wig cause a YouTuber said it was amazing. But what they didn't show me on camera was how they replucked the wig, bleached the knots, styled it, cut it and made it look so glamorous. I get it. I've been there. Then when you get the wig, you like, well, I don't even know what to do with it. How come it doesn't look as good as it looked on the YouTuber? Cause they didn't show you the finesse in the background. I didn't have to do anything to this wig, but my baby hairs <laughs> and bleach the knots. But just to give you a little bit of confirmation, I'm about to go ahead and include the unboxing video so that you can see what it looks like coming straight out of the package. This is what's coming to you. Again, this wasn't some type of YouTuber deal. They didn't even have an idea that I was a YouTuber because I bought it from Amazon, not directly from the company. So I didn't get any perks or, you know, they, they try to send the YouTubers the good wig sometimes. They not slick, we know, but y'all about to see what it looks like when you get it.
Thank you so, so much for watching. If you made it this far, go ahead and drop a purple heart down below. If you're new and you like what you see, don't forget to hit that subscribe button and tap on that notification bell one time for the one time. Thank y'all in advance for watching to the end of the video. I love y'all for free. Mm -hmm.